Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Crew Bites. Today let's try an easy and refreshing drink, perfect for summer or any special occasions. Custard Jelly Drink. It's a tasty drink made using custard powder, milk and topped with jelly and some dry or fresh fruits. This is a very simple recipe using basic ingredients and can be prepared in no time. So let's get started. So our first step is to prepare the jelly. So here I'm using strawberry flavored jelly, 85 grams. You can use any flavor of your choice. And for this, I need boiling water, 250 ml, and cold water or room temperature water, 200 ml. So I've added the jelly crystals to a dish and then I've added 250 ml of boiling water mix well so that the jelly crystals are completely dissolved in the water as you can see it's completely dissolved now to this I'm adding 200 ml of cold water so when you make the jelly you can you just follow the instructions on the package you are using each brand might be different so prepare the jelly according to the package instructions and now we're going to refrigerate this keeping it covered for about two to three hours or until the jelly is completely set now let's prepare the custard and for this you need full cream milk one liter please use full cream milk vanilla flavored custard powder three tablespoons sugar half cup or 100 grams so to a large pan or pot add one liter of full cream milk along with sugar half cup and vanilla flavored custard powder three tablespoons and now whisk the mixture well so that all the ingredients are mixed well and you get a very uh, you get a lump free mixture as shown and now we're going to transfer this to the stove keep a low flame and keep stirring continuously and cook the custard until it um, start to thicken slightly it will take just three to four minutes so keep stirring continuously as you can see the mixture is slowly coming to a boil and after that just one to two minutes it will be done you'll know that when the uh, spatula with back of your spatula you can see a thin layer of the custard coating as shown that's when you know the it's of the right consistency and now I'm going to switch off the flame and remove the pan from heat do not cook the custard for too long because we do not want it to be too thick it should be of a pourable consistency as shown now once cooled completely keep it refrigerated have transferred this to a different bowl and now chill in the refrigerator for about one to two hours meanwhile let's soak the basil seeds so here I didn't have basil seeds, so I've used chia seeds. So two to three tablespoons of chia or basil seeds soaked in water for about 20 minutes and then set aside. So now let's see how to serve this custard drink. So for this, you need some other ingredients like um, apple finely chopped two to three tablespoons seedless grapes a few you can use any other fruit of your choice like mango would be nice but this is completely optional some cashews finely chopped two to three tablespoons skinned and um, finely chopped almonds two to three tablespoons raisins two to three tablespoons if you want you can add pistachios the same quantity any other dry fruits of your choice like dates also here i'm using rose syrup two to three tablespoons this is optional you can use any other flavor of your choice if you want or you can completely omit this 
so this is our jelly as you can see it's well set now just cut into small cubes using a knife now using a spoon just separate the jelly pieces as shown and set this aside so this is the custard it's been in the refrigerator for two hours and it's very cold now to this add the soaked basil or chia seeds along with the jelly so i'm not adding all the jelly at once so i'm just adding um, three fourth of the jelly cubes also adding in some almonds cashews and raisins if you're adding dates or pistachios you can add that as well also adding in one to two teaspoons of rose syrup this is optional but it gives a nice refreshing flavor adding some ice cubes as well and give a good mix it's, it's very beautiful isn't it and now we're going to transfer this to a serving glass so just pour the custard drink into a serving glass at this stage I'm going to add some fresh fruits like apple seedless grapes if you're using mangoes you can use that as well also half a teaspoon of rose syrup this is optional Adding fresh fruits is also completely up to you, but it gives a nice refreshing um, taste to the drink. Give a good mix and then finally top it with some dry fruits like cashews, um, pistachios if you're using almonds and some of the jelly pieces. And there you go. A tasty and refreshing custard jelly drink is now ready to serve it's a very simple and tasty recipe perfect for summer or any other special occasions so please give it a try you will definitely love it you can add any other flavor of your choice you can add different flavors of jelly instead of strawberry jelly you can use mango pineapple or any other flavor of your choice so i hope you all enjoyed today's video also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe, like and share. New videos are uploaded every Tuesday and Friday. Until then, goodbye.